Welcome back. Another video of Chicago Motor Cars. I'm just not that stupid. You know, I find this a lot when researching uh, with Chicago Motor Cars. And the sad thing is we just, you just can't make a video on all of them. Of course, eventually we may. Um, but I find this a lot. No consistency in price. You know, when you have a product and it's worth $20, that's what you ought to sell it for. There should not be this wide range of pricing saying I'm going to sell it on this website for $20, but I think I can advertise it on this other website for $40 and hope that nobody catches it. Hope that nobody does their homework. You know, that's just bad business. Okay? Chicago Motor Cars is notorious for this. Case in point. 2006 Ferrari. They have it on their website, or they have it on eBay, $149,800. Now they've already determined basically that that's what they think the cars work because that's what they're willing to sell the car for. So in all reality, no matter where they advertise this car, it should basically be that price. Is that the way Chicago Motor Cars does it? No. Chicago Motor Cars prays on that you're not doing your homework and that maybe you might see the car on this website, fall in love with it, and pay them $167,000. So they're hoping you don't do your homework, you actually found the car on this website, and you pay them $20,000 over and above what you could have bought it on a different website. Chicago Motor Cars, you just don't quit, do you? Every little game that a used car salesman can play, you play. And you know what? It's coming to an end, buddy. It's coming to an end real fast. Chicago Motor Cars, shame on you.